easier for consistency because everybody else faded and muted just a little bit. But also I did have to, you know, remember things and keep things consistent so that I didn't, you know, add somebody with a sibling when they didn't say they had one before. So that kind of stuff I did have to keep up with. So are you keeping like a separate appendix someplace just for you or is it all up here? Uh, I'm pointing to my head for a podcast. <laughs> I, I wish that I had an appendix. I did for my series. I remember getting it from like my copy editor and I was so excited. I'm like, oh my gosh, all these details, their, their screen name and their, and it was wonderful. Um, did not have the same for this. So what I find is that I always have to have a copy of, um, like when I was writing Turning Point, I had to have a copy of Doughboys and Soda near me because I'd have to look back at certain stuff. Like I literally forget like, well, what was her last name? <laughs> you know? So, um, so I, I do have to keep, um, I do have to keep the other books handy. Okay. So Turning Point will be set in the, in, in the Cove universe. Yeah. The lens is on Rashida and Monique. And Turning Point comes out when? September 15th. September 15th, esteemed audience. I bet if you search hard enough, you might even could pre-order your copy right now. I bet you could. <laughs> <laughs> do you, do you, I, I know that you don't plan the individual novels, but do you have like kind of a plan for the cove that this is where they all get together for the infinity war or whatever? <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Um, I don't, you know, it's funny because I, I like to stay in a world for a long time because it helps me to get comfortable. It makes it easier to write because I know those characters so well. And I would love to do another Cove book. Um, I'd love to focus on the twins, Chris and Chrissy. But I don't know, we'll see. That's gonna be up to my publisher at this point. Uh, the next book after Turning Point is completely different because they wanted something completely different. Um, and it's completely different in that it's a totally separate world. It's first person point of view. And it scares me a little bit because I'm not as comfortable in writing in that point of view. I, I am seem to be the only person who finds that a difficult voice to write in. I am a freak of nature, apparently. <laughs> so I like I'm not person. sure that's what that means. Uh, <laughs> but it sounds like the book is sold, so you must have pulled it off. <laughs> uh, we'll see. <laughs> I'll let you know.